Greetings, fellow Atlanteans. It is I, Orion Otterking, and DC Fandom has gave us some great insider information on some new films that are coming out, and one of them is one of my favorite films from DC is Aquaman. Now, Aquaman is going to be have another movie, Aquaman 2, and I'm pretty I'm pretty excited about it. So, I don't have an Aquaman 2 figure to open up today, but I do have the Snyder Cut Justice League Jason Momoa Aquaman figure to open up. So make sure to like and subscribe so that you can see more unboxing videos once I do them. Alright. So, who's excited for the new Aquaman movie? I am, for sure can't wait it looks so awesome but right now we're gonna be opening up Aquaman from the Snyder Cut so let's take a look at him here's the front of the box Jason Momoa and here's the back Aquaman with his trident and then you can see all the other figures from the Justice League so let's let's open them up here we go. Now he looks like he only has the trident, a trading card, and a stand. So it's pretty good. Alright. So here he is. Let's take out the card. And stand first. So let's do that. Here's the lovely, ever useful stand along with the DC logo on it. Always useful. And the trading card. So here it is. Nice glossy finish. Always appreciated for all you trading card collectors. Now, Momoa. I'm gonna I'm gonna cut the little zip tie first, just to make it a little easier on myself. Cause you know how much zip ties bother me, especially with figures. But let's take out the trident first. Pretty, pretty massive trident. Pretty cool. Now, as you know, as well as some of you know, this is his mom's trident. This is before the Aquaman movie. Now, let's release the Momoa. Here's Aquaman, Aquaman Jason Momoa, awesome, awesome figure, awesome likeness, great detail in his armor. Now let's take a closer look. Here's Aquaman from the Snyder Cut by McFarlane Toys. He has his Atlantean armor, his mom's trident, and he's pretty badass, I gotta say. So let's take a closer look at him. So his gauntlets, you can like turn them, which is good, so they don't get in the way of the articulation. His shoulder pads, nice and soft. And so is, so is his armor, his top armor, so that's good, his chest armor. There's the back, a lot of detail in the sculpt. It's a pretty good likeness. 
Now, let's look at the articulation, shall we? His head. His arms, his elbows, or his shoulders, I should say. Double jointed. His biceps, wow. There we go. His elbows, double jointed. His wrists. And same on here. Double jointed elbows. Wrists. And again, this is a pretty good it's pretty good that the the gauntlets are on there loosely so that you know you could actually move them around so it doesn't inhibit you from articulating them. And he has the chest. It's a lot softer than the Flash's uh, chest armor, so that's good. So he can go forward more. He also has the waist and his hips, his knees, double jointed knees, his ankles, and his feet. Great for posing. Same on this side. All right. Now this is a little bit bent, but you can like put this in boiling water and then straighten it out. Uh, this goes right into his hand. Actually, let's put it into his left hand, just like in this, like in this card. It's a thick boy. There we go. So there, there is Aquaman. And we will do a side by side with the other Justice League characters sometime this week. So keep an eye out for that. All right, it's pretty awesome. Now that was Jason Momoa or Aquaman from the Snyder Cut and it was an awesome figure by McFarlane Toys and I can't wait to see the new movie that's coming out next year and there's going to probably be a lot of new toys from that movie and I can't wait to open all of them so make sure to like and subscribe so that you can watch along while I open up some of those figures right thanks for watching See you next time.